morning. I'm waiting because I think it's going to flip today. Anyways, are you ready for um, shoulder day? I am. <laughs> I, had, I had a reasonable amount of coffee today. <laughs> I have a problem with coffee. Yesterday, I was, the last two days, I've been sipping on oolong tea. I just leave um, a cold pitcher of tea out. I'm thinking, that's yeah, good for me. And then I'm thinking, why am I so tired? Because my caffeine level is down. So that raises a, a, a question in my mind. I got to ease off that. I don't want to drink coffee to keep myself up. So there's a new little um, goal. I am going to take on in the next two weeks. <laughs> My goal. Um, we got shoulders, right? Yeah. All right, let's do this. This first set is, it's eight reps, which means heavier, but make sure that you go through um, the, the, um, the four exercises with a lightweight first, and then maybe pick up heavier. I, I picked, um, three, five, and then tens. I don't know about that. Good morning. Hi, Linda. How are you? And Dawn. Awesome. Um, okay, I'm ready. Uh, body bomb there and just put us on camera so I can see that we're good. And I'm thinking, <laughs> I'm back to my whole coffee um, conundrum. I'm thinking, well, maybe for leg day for sure I'll, I'll caffeinate <laughs> and then I'm going to Google that today cutting caffeine there and there let's just go oh knees and legs from yesterday eh all right still a little chilly I'm going to leave my warm-up suit on <laughs> um here we go Nice rear delt fly. I want to use a little bit lighter. I was going to fool around with my um, uh, finger hand position and hit the rear delts in a different angle. Um, taking my baby fingers to the ceiling just to see. It should hit a little bit higher up. Here comes the W. Oh, I think they're still uh, a little bit toasty from Monday, huh? Uh, we've got the Cuban, um, the Cuban presses uh, later for that rotation. So this is a good time to really focus on seeing what's going on in the, that joint, warming it up, getting it some uh, mobility up and back. going to be challenging. So moving on, we've got three of these. Take a good rest in between. Choose your weights wisely. Um, and just imagine what this job is doing right now is warming up and it's pretty exhausting for that last set uh, of strict press where we're going to want to really push um, a heavier weight. Uh, and because we're tired now, we're pre-exhausting we might not have to lift as much weight as you might think. I always like that. I always like that. Okay, here we go. Ready to go when you are.
love you. And I'll be back. Good? Feeling good? Flip to the threes on that last one. Tiring, eh? Little muscle group taking all that work overloads quickly. Number one, number two, we did shoulders on Monday with uh, chest and three. Shoulders are involved in now everything, right? Oh, except, yeah, you know what? Even legs, like if you're holding those weights or if you're um, intensifying your leg workout and you got overhand. Last set here. I'm gonna go with the light ones. Pipe push up, oh boy. Oh boy, get your mouth guards on. <laughs> Out. W. Ready. Almost ready. I'm going to do the last few with a side lateral just to get that feeling. There, there, there. And just hit it in all directions to make sure it's working. Everything's working. Pipe push up. That is, in a pike position, your nose diving into the floor. Um, with your feet close together, it's more difficult. You can take it out to a wider stance, makes it easier. And you could also do it on um, an elevated platform. You just want to hit, um, you know, the, the, the chest and shoulders, all right? Uh, band laterals, got it, and front. All right, let's do this. Um, like, I, I mean, I like to do my pipes in a definite wide stance, all right? How uh, you choose your um, position. So again, if you have a, um, mm, I'm going to get that for next one. 
if you have uh, the bench, you could elevate and do your pipe push up there, right? Just want to focus here. Hey, if you want to go harder, <laughs> go into a, stand, a handstand position against the wall and do some, do some of those guys. All right, here we go. With, I'm just going to go light at first and see what is this 10? Yeah, I have these 10s. So let's go for some side laterals. Good. 10 and 10. and modify your stance if you're getting fatigued, okay? So if you're here on close stance, go a little wider. Or if you're wide, go to elevated. Try and keep the 10 without hurting yourself. <laughs> uh, there we go. Oh, feel that in the hamstrings too, eh? Watch your, the blood that rushes to your head right there. That's another consideration. Oh, side lateral. Nice. Feeling good? Um, again, if you're having issues with shoulders, you're doing this with no weight or no resistance. You're going through um, physiotherapy type um, movements. All right? Therapeutic. It's not time to overload a joint than when it's inflamed or in pain. Um, oh, did I go front? No. Today, I love, you don't have to do too much um, to overload a, a muscle group like this when you feel that good, beneficial burn. I'm procrastinating. <laughs> if you're resting, you know, maybe stretch it out. Um, a, a nice manipulation for your shoulders or movement, manipulation, move, a movement is those uh, circles. With a heavier weight, it like kind of pulls and then rotates, right? I learned that a long time ago at a physio. Guys, 
Take your time. Do your thing. I'm thinking about the next thing. I was looking at the band Y. Alrighty. and your core tense if it's traveling down your back. Come into a stretch and just acknowledge it. Take care of it after the workout and on Saturdays. when my foot's on the left, in my left. Interesting. Um, that's it, right? So here comes our band Y, and then the Cuban. And then um, we've done shrugs already. I think we did shrugs yesterday, back day, on um, back day, Tuesday. So this time when you're doing shrugs, let's lean back slightly or, right? or just keep your arms behind your back and shrug that way, okay? So that's getting that whole um, trap shoulder, upper back, all right? All right. How's this gonna look? I love this band. Yards and yards of ribbon. I think that'll work. I'm going to cross it so it doesn't snap in my face. I've seen that tragic tragedy. Oh, 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 oh. This is good. <laughs> Making stuff up as I go along. All right, here we go. Everything is really hard and your lips just oh cuban that's down here rotate up and press okay let's see we'll give it a go and then that shrug too much too much for the rotation i can lift um the presses but we're gonna do a strict press after this. So go ahead and do lighter weights if necessary. Um, if that rotation is um, uncomfortable. It's this, and I think it's because it's not warm really. I'm just gonna take it easy and see if I can go a little further each rep. Good. Nine and ten. <laughs> Barely. Barely. Ha! Ah! Band wide when you're ready. Holy. Glad I have energy today. <laughs>
shrug. I think I forgot the shrug. Sorry about that. I don't know. I think I forgot the shrug because this was so painful. <laughs> oh, that was convenient. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's it for that one, even with the fives. Okay, so two different things happen there. Try and um, stay away from this shrug, right? And the shrug comes with your shoulders up and back, and you can really feel a lot of that muscle pull in. And then it's um, surrounding groups and helper groups getting pulled in there. All right, we're doing good. Oh, all righty, ready to go. Last set um, of the these, and then we go to the presses. Oh, four. <laughs> I kill me sometimes. Good, we got this, we got this. Let's go. I thought I could do it all, I can't. Feel all right? Check it out. Good. Um, Cuban. I'm gonna go with lighter ones and see if I can get that rotation. lighter ones when you really focus on the movement and you bring all an energy and attention to it it's harder it's um intensifies the movement same with life i think right whatever you focus on here comes our shrugs And 10, haha. All right, I have chosen 17s. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking at the beginning. I might not be able to get it. Strict press means you're not moving. So when I go strict, I'm gonna go right here and it's gonna be all here. Which means I got no, not a lot of momentum helping me. So you might go lower in weights and that's what I might do. I just don't know at this point. Sometimes you surprise yourself. So. Um, of course, being safe, uh, push yourself. Every week, try something that you don't think you can do, right? You can always lower the weight, uh, modify the movement, but you will be surprised at yourself. Oh boy, I hope I'm surprising myself today. I love it when I do that. All right, eight. I'm gonna go six to eight reps. No problem. Nice. All right, you guys. Beautiful. Feels good. Set number two. 
six to eight reps. Feels good. If I had a spotter, if I was training with my partner, I would probably take a little extra rest and go up and wait as long as I had that spotter there to keep me steady. Be so surprised how much more you can do. Like if you had a spotter behind you and they put one finger there, <laughs> that gives you so much confidence and um, uh, it just helps with your, your lifts which seemingly it shouldn't, but it does. Two more, we got two more. All right, you guys. Safe down. You know, really got to count that last rep coming down as one of your reps. You have to get that into your head. Um, otherwise, you're like those muscle heads that are throwing weights in the gym. It's like not necessary. Not necessary. Good. We got one, two. Oh, we got one more set to go. <laughs> I'm standing up here anyways. This might be a tragedy, but at least you're there to call 911. If it goes awry. All right. Six to eight. Funny thing is, that was hard, that it was this, the grip, not my wrist, but my thumb at the attachment there. Very interesting. I think it's that one weight, the uh, neoprene one, it's got a wider grip. I don't know. That's just what I'm thinking. I like to make things make common sense because I don't want this to be a problem. And if I make... If I assign it um, a cause to it, I can, I have control, right? I have control. I can say I can fix that. All right, that's enough for me, you guys, today. Um, stick around if you want to do your Tabata, your um, cardio. It's, it's still rough out there. When I was walking this morning, boy, the ice in the water. Um, so it might be indoor cardio. And your stretch, just your stretch here maybe, again for that shoulder. We don't need too much more work on that today and we will get to it on Saturday. A little more upper body, good. Just a nice easy tempo back and forth. And of course, as always, your breathing, all right?
talk to you tomorrow. We've got um, arms, arms and abs. That's always a beauty. A beauty day because it's Friday too. All right. Thanks for coming, you guys. Enjoy your Thursday.